Children in a Pot. This may look like it's straight from the playbook of a nursery rhyme witch, but it's actually a move from an ingenious mom. Dr. Marie Harper and her family found themselves with rolling power outages and no running water because of snow and ice storms in Shreveport, Louisiana. We barely get snow at all in Shreveport, let alone snow that's going to stick to the ground and stick around for a while. I mean, it's just unprecedented. Bath time can be a challenge in any family, but the Harpers have five children ages six and under, and at the time, no running water. It had been about 48 hours since they'd had a bath, and um, we'd been playing outside, and um, you know, they were dirty. So the Harpers used the resources they had, a giant pot normally reserved for crawfish boils, and snow. I took a bucket and filled up the pot with snow, just scooped it with a bucket and poured it into the pot, and then you put, put the pot on top of the burner, and then my husband fires up the burner from underneath. After safely cooling off the bottom of the pot in snow to make sure the metal wasn't too hot for the kids, in they went. We just put them in one at a time, bathed them off, toweled them off, and brought them back inside, and then that was it. We didn't even change the water between them. <laughs> I figured they would have been in the same bathtub together if we were inside, so there was not much reason to change the water. <laughs> While it may have been an unusual week without power and water, the Harpers were having a little fun with their situation. We had a lot of kind of craziness going on, but we weren't really suffering over here either. <laughs> so, you know, we made the best with what we had. This is Inside Edition Digital.